Tech News. My name is Adria Kiriwi. First, the headlines. Netflix is finally going after password sharing. True Color to end its call recording feature as Google updates Play Store policy. Google's sub C cable in Africa arrives in Lagos to improve internet speed. Plus, Binance limits services in Russia after EU sanctions. Details shortly after the break. Thank you. Thank you for staying tuned. Kindly like, share and subscribe to the channel. Now the news in details. Netflix plans to finally address the rampant practice of password sharing after the platform reported its first subscriber loss in more than a decade. The video streamer doesn't plan to simply freeze those shared accounts. Instead, the company will likely favor the setting of an extra fee for those accounts being used by multiple people outside of the home. Netflix plan to capture that lost revenue will start with an alert being sent to account holders whose passwords are being used by other households. The company has already started a test of this feature in Peru, Costa Rica and Chile. The company also allows people who use a shared password to transfer their personalized profile information to either a new account or a sub-account, allowing them to keep their viewing history and recommendations. True Color has announced that it will not offer its core recording feature from May 11. The development comes soon after Google announced that it has updated its Play Store policy restricting the access of third-party applications to the Accessibility API from May 11. It is to be noted that first-party dialer apps and the Google dialer pre-installed on phones will still allow users to record phone calls in specific regions. It is likely that Google has brought this change to provide more privacy to Android users and to comply with call recording laws globally. TrueColor said in a statement that call recording on TrueColor was free for everyone, permission-based and required users to enable the feature using Google Accessibility API, adding that the company introduced call recording feature for all Android smartphones after receiving an overwhelming consumer demand. However, True Color further stated that as part of the updated Google Developer Program policies, they are unable to offer call recording any longer. American technology giant Google has announced the arrival of its subsea cable Equiano in Lagos, Nigeria. The submarine cable, which is landing in the second city in Africa, is expected to improve broadband penetration and quality of service, as well as advance the digital economy in Nigeria by 2025. This was made known in a note by Google's West Africa director, Juliet Ehimwana Chiazo, where she said that the cable landed in Lagos, making it its second successful landing in Africa after it reached Togo last month. Binance, the largest crypto exchange by trading volumes, said on Thursday it is limiting services for Russian nationals that have crypto assets exceeding 10,000 euros in light of European Union's latest sanctions against Russia. Earlier this month, the EU, in its fifth package of sanctions against Moscow, had targeted crypto wallets, banks, currencies and trust to close potential loopholes that could allow Russians to move money abroad. Binance said Russian nationals or the legal entities in Russia who have crypto account balances that exceed 10,000 euros will be given 90 days to close their positions. And that's all for now. Thank you so much for joining us. Do not forget to leave a thumbs up, share and subscribe to the channel. My name is Adrian.